And so we are obviously going way yeah, more colorful than go. usual. Um, and I absolutely Don't adore it. Excuse me, sir. Did you steal you that? Did you steal one. that from Mama? No one I don't want to like be mean towards her, but she is kind of a bitch sometimes. You this is my depression center, and she's beautiful. Oh, I love her. The rain cloud. Now, I her and then I have all of the depression coping skills on the sleeve. Not morning, afternoon. I have been not filming this week. I hurt my back doing the, well, not even doing, just like the dumbest way by sitting in a chair that was so apparently uncomfy. My posture was so horrible that my back has been hurt for the past two days. And so I haven't like, like even doing this right now is painful. I, I don't know. I don't know how that happened, but it did. Um, my, I don't think I've updated you guys on my application job. I think I told you. If I didn't, then um, we didn't get, us like outside readers didn't get laid off in January like I thought we were going to. Um, we just got limited down to like maximum of five hours a week, which is basically laying us off right um but this week it was unlimited applications which turned out to not be that way but during the unlimited time apparently i did too many applications because they ran out um again they uh said you could do as many as you want so i was just like busting my butt just working 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 and um i guess my chair and slunching over did something to me and so i just haven't been wanting to do anything uh long story long short story long <laughs> um uh, hello the house is destroyed absolutely destroyed every day it's like this it's only 3 p.m right now and you would think that I haven't cleaned in weeks and it's 
it was clean this morning. I can promise you that. Um, but it is no longer, and that's because I have this little monster, don't I? Yeah. <laughs> uh, so anyways, I just wanted to stop in and let you know that, so it's when, no, it's Thursday, and Sunday is the show. And what I have to do prep-wise um, I'm waiting on my new business cards to come in and they're really important because my business cards are also my clothing tags and I have pretty much ran out. I think I could, if they don't come in, I could get by using my old tags. I think I have just enough to where I wouldn't have to like use paper ones. Like they'd still be nice looking, but my new ones are updated and have my QR code on it. Um, and so I hope they come in. They're by Vistaprint. I ordered them a couple weeks ago, um, but I just got regular shipping because when they gave the estimate date, it was before the show. So we'll see. Um, but I am so excited. You have, I think I say that every time, but I am so excited for the new stuff. I just came out with it. I know I told you I'm going to come out with new things, but um, I think I had hinted that I had came up with an idea, but I didn't want to just like create it without like researching and making sure and like sleeping on it, making sure that's what I want to do. And I did. And like I'm making it way more of a big of a deal than it is because it's literally just an embroidered sweatshirt collection. Um, but if you guys know me and my embroidery machine, we fight a lot. We are just like, I don't wanna like be mean towards her, but she is kind of a bitch sometimes, all the time actually. Um, and it's like my fault because it's user error. Like I clearly am doing something to upset her. Um, I just like, I'm new at embroidery, and I'm just starting to like get the hang of it and then like some of them will be perfect and then all of a sudden something will happen and she does something that I just confuse you know embroidery is machine embroidery uh because I've, I don't hand embroider uh, not yet at least but machine embroidery they're finicky they are finicky but what I did is it, I'm calling it my um feelings forecast collection and forecast for weather feelings obviously emotion i love them i will show you i did four of each sweatshirt um so i didn't go crazy like i normally do so we have this is the happy one this is today's vibe sunshine so she's happy and this one is my, oh, I love this one. My Stormy, so um, angry one, today's vibe. The colors, the colors. Oh, and I love her too. Today's vibe, this is like the sad one, obviously. And then, this is not like, val I know it's going to seem Valentine's Day because I'm not doing any like um, seasonal collections, but I want to do like an in love one, and I love her. She's raining hearts, and it says today's vibe. And white and so we are obviously going way more colorful than usual um, and I absolutely adore it it's the cutest stuff I swear and I use my um, tear away inside stabilizer and I think that just looks so much more professional and I am so excited to like debut these on Sunday and see how they do and then based on the reaction I get in person um, I may make a few I will put them online I will I'm just not gonna have a big stock and I'm gonna keep restocking it but like probably only a couple of each size each restock so we'll see how they do I need to come up with some fun video ideas for them because like that's the real way to get like online sales is through social media. Um, but then wait for it. I didn't just do that. I did some bookmarks and they are beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Every time I walk by them, I just smile because they are gorgeous. So let me show you. Are you kidding me look at them i i just got done doing some cat ones i'll do some filming of me making them um later because i have a few more cat ones i want to get done before the show um but are you serious look at them they're just they're beautiful oh that's part of the reason i forgot that's part of the reason i need my business cards because they're going to be the backing for it um so i really do hope those come in 
because I didn't think that one through. I do need that. I think I have to bookmark like contain. I could I could figure it out, but yeah, um, so beautiful. And I unboxed the video, so like I got these from Timu for like ten bucks. I love them. Look how cute those are. Those are perfect for them. like the bookmarks, which is what I got them for. Hello, I. Love, love, love. I also am sporting one of my um, Stanley charms that I made. This is B for Brittany. B for bitch. <laughs> no, I I think it's adorable. Kind of want to like put a few more charms on this one. I need to play around with that to see what I want to, if I want to like add any more. I need to add those online too. So, oh, um, excuse me, sir. Did you steal that? Did you steal that from mama? Are you feeling lovey? <laughs> he took off the kitchen towel yesterday and he likes to like put stuff over his head and walk around, but he ran into the wall because he couldn't see through it um, and just had a complete meltdown. So uh, it's been fun. <laughs> All right, I am gonna go clean up this mess and I will see you guys doing more bookmarks. My own world of make-believe Kids screaming in the cradles Profanities I see the world through ice covered in ink and bleach Cross out the ones who heard my cries And watch me weep I love everything Fire spreading all around my room my world's so bright, it's hard to breathe, but that's alright. Hush. about this setup. I think this is so adorable. So I have my six foot table here. And then what I think I'm going to do is because I have an eight foot space, but nothing like, um, protruding. So like all flat, um, one, like, what am I looking? It's all horizontal, right? So I have two more feet I can put over here. I'm going to bring two, these like, what is it? Two, three, four, five, six, these eight bins. And I, that's what I'm gonna use to store my uh, clothing for people to look at. And I'm gonna, I got these off of Timu. I can't believe I have not like purchased them until now. They are 
wonderful. They look so good. I think I'm gonna put mediums on my mannequins. Well, not mannequins, whatever. Um, because the smaller, the better, I think, on those because they're not like, the hangers themselves kind of look kid size. So this smaller neckline, the better. Um, but wow, yeah. Okay, so I need to, in the meantime, um, figure out how much stuff I'm gonna bring. Because obviously, well, I can sp like put some things under. I don't have my cups on display. I got this from Amazon and it sucks. So I hate it. It is the worst and it's the flimsiest. And on it, it came broken. Like this part underneath on the end, like came broken. So it's not even, it's so flimsy. I literally can't even put a glass here because it's not sturdy enough. It just sinks down. So I figured I can do two here. Um, I think three on this one and then I think there were three on the top, but it's, there's no way that it's going, I'm, I don't even know if it's going to make it to Cincinnati with me before it breaks. There's no way I'm going to be coming home with that. I do know that. Um, so I don't know if I want to bring my backup one. I have one of my old like acrylic ones. One of them died at my last show. So like, we'll see, which is unfortunate because... They actually look pretty good when I had two of them, but I, they're not like long enough to fit a glass. So the whole time at the show, I like was worried about them falling off anyways. These are wide enough to fit a glass, but it's just not sturdy enough to hold them, which is stupid because I looked up candle displays. So this was supposed to be a candle display. You cannot tell me candles will like sit on this. There's no way. It had mixed reviews. Some people said it was good. Some people said it was the worst and it only lasted a show. So it sucks because it was $20 spent. That probably should have went towards the $70 nice one that I was looking at where I just couldn't justify buying it. But now I should have. Um, this is beautiful. I have, I'm going to bring, I have two of these geode uh, book, uh, what do you call them? Book, um, wow. I know this word, book ends, there it is. Uh, but I only need two, because I'm just gonna smash it up. And they're heavy, so like, do I really even wanna bring one? No, but I need to, uh, and I think it looks cute. And then here's my little stand. I had this little shelf. It was supposed to fit both of these on it perfectly. Um, I even measured it, but the measurements that they had on their site were off, because that does not fit on there. It's just not wide enough, which is odd, because you'd think it'd be the same dimension, but it is not. But I did buy this stand, so I think it looks fine on top of it. I don't know. I like I like having a different height, so I think I will bring that just to give a different height. It's just a little odd to have a basket and not use it as a basket. Then about that thing too. I got both of these at a flea market for like fifteen dollars for the two of them together. I was like, that's a good deal. And then I need to. I know that's blank right now. I have purple and blue ones that I'm going to be putting um, some transfers on tonight or tomorrow. And I'm probably going to just like uh, rainbow color them in there and then put extras underneath. The only thing I don't like is having the Stanley so far away from the Stanley charms. So I don't know if I want to bring a couple charms just laying out in front of it. I might do that. And I still need to put out, I have my like wooden and black signs where I'm just going to, um, I have to draw on them first and then put it out. Actually, maybe I won't use them. I'll just have my pretty little photo frame price list. I also got my new uh, business cards and they're so pretty. Look at this. Okay, so the front. Now I should have made this darker because you could not, barely see the white ring around it. I'll bring you closer with the camera. I don't think it's going to pick it up. There is a white ring. It's very, very faint, but it's there. In person, it's more there. And then the back has my QR code on it, which will bring up all my socials and my Etsy store and my email. And it's so cute. I got it from Vistaprint. I bought 250. I did not get them on sale. They always run sales. So like if you want to get business cards, like wait, I just didn't have time. Like I needed them and I had waited too long to order them. So I'm glad they came, but overall, like this is the setup that's going to be flush against the table because it has to be, I need to measure and make sure it's not longer than two feet, but I'm pretty sure that it's 12 and 12, hopefully, because <laughs> I really need those since I can't bring a clothing rack. 
All right, I will update you guys once I figure out what I wanna do, like what I wanna actually bring. And then I need to load this up by tomorrow and put it in Randy's car so we can head off on Sunday because it's Friday today. Okay, love you. Oh, I guess I'll, I'll show you guys my face. Um, it's dry. It's very dry, like on my corners here. Um, it's really gross out today. I did not, my back is still hurting, so I didn't go to the gym. So I've just been in loungewear all week, really. And um, I probably will film some of me doing my DTF prints because I have my, I think I showed you. That's, you know, I mean, that is it. It's sad ish. It's my new coping skills um, DTF print. And I need to do four of those on shirts. And then, like I said, I have some more of those Stanley pouches and I want to put some of these on it. So. I'll film that, but I probably won't talk during it. Uh, so you guys won't actually see my talking face again until tomorrow. So I will see you then. Bye. That was awful. That packing video was so awful. It's the night before the show, day before. It's only like 2-ish, 30 p.m. So I need to hustle and get everything packed up so I can pack up the truck. And I think I'm gonna put everything in it except for my glassware because I'm a little nervous. It's gonna get in the negatives tonight and I don't think glass does well with extreme temperatures. So to avoid that chaos, uh, that's gonna be tomorrow's packing and tagging and bagging is the last thing i need to do now i'm obviously done making things oh no i'm not Ugh. i still need to put on i don't think i showed you guys this in the video but i did the press on these pouches for my stanley and I need to put a charm. I like doing charms on the keychain just to be um, cute. So you know my black fitness ones have a smiley face. I think I'm gonna do, I have these really cute clouds because weather theme, uh, emotions is kind of the theme, at least right now. Um, I have some clouds to put on there. So I think that'd be a cute charm. And then I wanted to do some of the earrings, I was playing around with a different design and I want to do a lot of them like that because it is so pretty. So here are the old earrings. It was just a simple stud pearl. And I made, how gorgeous are these? It's a little star clear bead. Then I put a little couple stars on it. Um, yeah, I wanna do more of those because I love them. And I think other people will like them too. So. That's gonna be the last thing I have to make today. And it's if I want to, you know, I, like I don't have to do that. I do have to do the charms on these though. Like that is a must in my mind for just my own sanity with it. I like it like that. Um, I have a Jaden's printer, a thermal printer. I got it from Poshmark because I, I whenever I have Poshmark credit, I end up using it even though I was saving it for a while to get Randy a PS5 and I had just enough money and then I just blew it. I blew, blew that. And Christmas, like I was using money for gifts for people on Poshmark. So anyways, um, he doesn't have <laughs> a PS5, um, but I did get a Jaden's printer. And I found these on Timu, these like 
non like these are so expensive on amazon they're like 20 dollars. i found this for three dollars on timo and i wasn't sure it was even going to be thermal paper because like when you're on timo there's a lot of like descriptions that are 26 words long and they have many things in it where it's like it could be thermal printer paper because that's in the title but also says printer paper so like i didn't know if it was going to be and it is i I am so stoked. So I'm going to be putting these on the tags um, because I want to tag everything with a sticker and instead of like because some shows you have to have the price on every piece like you can't just have a sign that says the prices um, and so I wanted to have something non-written that looks better. Um, I did have to practice a lot like you're going to have to make a custom label on I'm sure I don't know for sure I've only ever used Jaden but like on the app for Jaden they let you do like a custom like make your own label and so like I had to practice many times to get the, the sizing correct on it but we found it so I need to put those on the tags and I need to tag the new pieces and I need to bin them and I need to uh what do you call uh lint roll every one of them because I do have a cat friendly home and I don't want kitty hairs on them so Let's get into it. Oh, I didn't show you guys the sweaters. Here is the saddish, the, this is my depression sweater and she's beautiful. Oh, I love her. The rain cloud, I told you guys weather themed. And then I have all of the depression coping skills on the sleeve. She is just darling. I am gonna have such a hard time deciding what three sweaters to put on the mannequins. The, I keep calling them mannequins, the uh, shirt things. I have three options, so Ugh, I have to take down. I know I told you guys I wasn't going to use the organizer anymore, but like, let's face it, I have not much to work with with this one, only being an eight foot length table. So I'm going to do the six foot table and then the two. I hope they're going to let me do it. If not, I'm going to have to just like play around with putting them on the table as a display. We'll see. We'll see how that goes. Um, yeah, now it's enough talking. I need to get to doing now. Ugh. Okay, okay, okay. Where do I even start? Where do I even start? I guess I'll let you guys watch. <laughs> What I have, what I'm bringing, it feels like a lot less than normal. There's two bags, there's three bins, and then that really annoyingly fragile um, cheap cup thing. Oh, and then two boxes of cups. So it shouldn't be too bad actually getting it inside the venue, which is good because it looks like it might be difficult um, accessing it. But I've never actually been there. But from the photos, it looks large, and I think there might be stairs involved. But it could be wrong. So, we're gonna pack this up. I'm gonna shower. I actually need to find my square reader. Now that that's fresh in my mind, I need to find that because that is like the most important thing because everyone uses card. Okay, I'm gonna find that and I will see you guys in the morning. I need to charge my batteries, so. That's the end of this vlog and then you'll see me in my next vlog for the Ryan guys are on Vine market. Wish me luck. Bye.